Welcome to Polka Buzz, Western New York's only television dance party show. Brought to you by Key Liquors in the Value Plaza, Chictawaga. And by Bob Shiz Pierogi in the famous Broadway Market, Buffalo. And now, here's your host, Ron Dombrowski. Well, I want to welcome all of you to Polka Buzz on WBBZ-TV. And before we go any further, a happy Matka Day. That's right. It is Mother's Day, and a happy, blessed Mother's Day to all the moms out there. And not only is it Mother's Day, but there's uh, some special things on today's program. You're going to see someone for the first time try to play a trumpet, like Angelo Cicatello. And accordion bill just might be lurking in the crowd and you never know he might show up let's uh let's listen to rare vintage
with Angelo Sicatello, who's the sales manager of WBBZ TV. He's the guy that goes out and uh, gets those businesses to advertise on Polka Buzz. And by the way, before we go any further, Angelo, I want to tell the people if they go into any business that advertises on WBBZ TV, regardless if it's on Polka Buzz or Beat the Champ or any of their shows, Tell the folks that you heard it and watched it and seen it on WBBZ. Very important. We appreciate our advertisers, we appreciate our sponsors, and they appreciate your business. So please tell them you saw it on TV. Now, before we go any further, yes. that, that shirt, it looks so familiar. You know, it was about 34 years ago I bought it from you on a night much like this. Uh, so it's pretty unique and pretty interesting that we're standing here today and doing this show in 2018. And you know the guy upstairs, Big Steve's looking down on us, and he's probably so proud that we are, uh, we've, we've put together another TV polka show, much like Steve and I had back in the 80s. Well, Western New York has embraced this program. It's great that you and I have been friends for 30-something years, and it's wonderful we've been able to bring this to Western New York. You know, this whole thing started back then when my mom and dad brought me down to the Polish Falcons Club, yep. and I would dance on the TV show. And who would have imagined, 35 years later, we to bring a show much like this back to Western New York, and I would appear for one song playing the trumpet. That's, That's pretty cool. That's right. You're going to be doing that. It's uh, coming up. Yeah, coming up. I'm going to be up for one tonight. My debut. I've already had four bands ask me to be, uh, you know, in the band with them. I'm not ready for that yet. So we'll, we'll see how it goes tonight. Okay. Hey, very good. But yeah, Polka Saturday Night with Big Steve and the Bel Airs. It was a great time. And uh, if anybody wants copies of the tape, I have them for two dollars each. So. Okay. All right. I think I charged you what? Fifty cents? Too much. Too much. You Two dollars? Too much for this, Ron. Okay. I don't know. Okay. All right, let's get back to more music. Thanks. Hey, you Jeff. Ladies and gentlemen, I have the privilege of singing with the finest band in Western New York, Rare Vintage. And everybody has to be quiet because I heard Ron Dombrowski is coming and I'm so excited. He's a very, very famous, he's got like seven or nine radio programs. I hope he shows up pretty soon. Let me ask this chubby guy over here. Is, is Ron Dombrowski coming here? I don't know, Ron Dabrowski. I, I heard he was going to be here. Oh. Ronnie D's here. No, <laughs> I love Ronnie D. Ronnie Who's Ronnie the best? Me. Hey, Ronnie D. Hey, Cardi and Bill. I was talking about you all week. 
on the radio. I, I'm so happy. Did my mother's happy too, yeah. Did you hear me? I heard you. Yeah. Okay. My mother was happy too. Talk in here? Oh, he wants me to talk into a mic. Because you have to talk so the people oh, can hear you, which, which mic? Well, this guy, I don't know. I could talk into both mics. Are you going to sing the song with me? Uh, you're going to sing it. I'm going to, like, lip sync it. Thank God. Or I mean, oh, that's maybe I'll try. We, we've done this before. So now let's see got, if I get better. Hey, we got a rookie here tonight. He's playing a uh, The trumpet. Italian kid. The Italian is yeah, funny. Big kick. debut, I don't know. All right, don't ruin it. I mean, well, don't do really it. loud. Do a yeah, good job. Wait a minute. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. Are you doing a Krupnik or the beer? Krupnik song. Okay. The it's... most famous song <laughs> in Western New York. I get requests oh, for it all the time. It gets requests all over the yeah. world. I, I get them. They come, yeah. come in. A lady from China emailed me. Really? Yeah, she wanted Chinese Krupnik. No way. Yes. I like Chinese Krupnik. <laughs> yeah. I yeah. have it with uh, Hu Flung Pu. I have that too. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a Chinese Yeah, name. yeah. It's good. Good stuff. All right. Well, we're going to sing pretty soon. Is Angelo ready to blow his horn? Angelo, you ready? You going to blow your horn? Here you go. I think we need some room up here, though. Blow your horn. Blow your horn. Have fun. Hey, don't watch. You want me to lose weight? <laughs> Should I get? Angelo is Who do you want me? You're sweating. It's hard to Make fit sure everybody up here. You're sweating. Applause when he's all done. <laughs> Who's your teacher, Angelo? This guy. D, host the Polka Buzz here at the Potts Banquet Hall, and you know what I have with in front of me here? You guys, uh, you heard them uh, perform. Jerry, of course, the leader of Rare Vintage. Angelo Sicatello, probably the new trumpet player for the band. But anyhow, let's find out how this all came about, Jerry. 
Someone called me up one day and said, well, I haven't touched a trumpet in like 25, maybe 30 years or something like that. It's hard to believe because I'm only 19. And uh, being from Italian extraction, this guy loves Polish music. Well, my so mom was Polish, remember. Okay. So. so he decided he wants to take some trumpet lessons. So comes in once a week faithfully for a half an hour lesson and does top, one of my good students well, for not playing for so long, you know. Jerry lives in this big, big, big mansion in Chictawaga, yeah. and we always do it in his family room. That's where the trumpet lessons take place. And he cranks it up to about 95 degrees, so it's nice and comfortable, and the horns, really, they stay in tune, and it's, it's great. So. You do a good job. You do a good, you do a good we job. have a lot of fun. <laughs> what are you doing? So have you hired him? Uh, yeah, maybe you want to do the next set? Zad Vadulati, two bucks. Oh, you're going to do it. He's going to do it, maybe. huh? Oh, yeah. okay. We're going to have him play a lot of Polish songs, Abedek, Rylanders, whatever. Then I'll maybe teach him how to triple tongue a little bit, you know. We're oh, getting oh. there. Okay. One step at a time. All right, good. All right, hey, thank you, guys. In you're fact, welcome. speaking of, one last thing. Jerry, thank you. I mean it sincerely. Thank you. 34 years I wanted to do this. I appreciate it. Thank you, Channel 5, WBBZ, TV, Potts Banquet Hall, and all these great musicians here. That's good. Keep it up. Thank you. Keep it up. Yeah, we certainly are blessed. And let's get back to more music. Hey, Okay, yes, it's Ronnie D here at the Potts Banquet Hall in Polka Buzz, and look who I have next to me. This young lady. I'm falling in love. What is your name? Janelle Sabin. I'm the scorekeeper on Beat the Champ. I knew that. Yeah. I knew that pretty face, and I love your shirt. Thank you, thank you. Yep, bringing out my Polish heritage here at Polka Buzz tonight, so I'm really happy to be here, and thanks so much for having me. Is this the first time you've been to Polka Buzz? Yes, this is the first time I've been at Polka Buzz, and I'm so excited to see what we have going on here. I can't wait to get down on the dance floor tonight. And I hope you come back. Oh, definitely. Of course I'll come back, if you'll have me. Oh, we'll have you for sure, yeah. Awesome. <laughs> By the way, um, how long have you been scorekeeping for Beat the Champ? So I've been scorekeeping for Beat the Champ since we brought it back to TV um, January of 2016. So we're on our third year now, and I cannot believe the following we have and how much it's grown, so I'm, I'm so grateful for that. I, I have to agree, it's uh, it's amazing what this TV station has done to uh, bring local programming back to Western New York. It's incredible, and we can't thank the fans enough. It's all to you guys watching at home. Hey, thank you. Oh, thanks, Ronnie. Back to more music.
Well, before we say goodbye, accordion bills with me, and I want to ask you, where did you come from? I came from my house. Well, I came from my mother. It's oh, Mother's Day. It's Mother's Day. Yes. Your mother and my mother were mothers. <laughs> that, that makes sense. sense. Happy Mother's Day, yes. Mother. I love yes. mothers. I, wanna, I love my mother. I want to wish all the moms a very happy oh, Mother's Day. Happy, happy On mother's behalf day. of accordion Bill and Ronnie and the, D and the ownership and management of WBBZ TV and Rare Vintage. Rare Vintage. And all our fans here, your yeah. fans, I should say. And all our fans at Potsdelli. They're your fans. Our fans. They're yours. Your fans. Okay. Whoever. Your mother and my mother are mothers. Yeah. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. <laughs> and we'll talk to you tomorrow at 5 o'clock on WXR.